Uh, salutations, everyone, and thank you for rejoining me here in Hoi 4 4.0 Expert AI mod included, in which we are going to do a time lapse against the evils of the, well, basically the allies. Hopefully, by the end of this, the United Kingdom will capitulate. But regardless, I hope you enjoy the time lapse of me trying to do my best to invade North and South America.
Alright, my friends, so I know that wasn't a perfect time lapse. I could have done a little better on that, but here we are. Um, the USA, actually, it was a little annoying to take out, but it was actually a little better than normal. I don't know if it's just the Expert AI 4.0 mod, but it was actually a little easier than what I'm a little used to when you invade the US, especially as Japan. It is now 1952. Mexico wasn't too bad. Uh, I lost a lot of tanks. <laughs> Taking out North America, but that's okay. I actually ran out of armored cars, uh, but we need to talk about a couple other things. I made, I gave Venezuela all of this stuff over here. British Guiana, you know, it is what it is. Venezuela probably lost a lot of dudes, but they, I rewarded them, and then, as well as Peru. I was surprised Peru actually joined us, but I gave them all of Bolivia to make them feel better about themselves, and I took the rest of South America, which looks pretty good. Uh, Germany owns pretty much all of Southern... Oh no, that's not Germany. I guess it's Norway. Ah, it doesn't matter. It really doesn't matter. Norwegian, German, they all basically have the same flag, which is really unfortunate. I gave Spain a little bit more African territories. I gave Italy quite a bit more African territories, as well as not really France. Uh, of course, Spain got Portugal. Okay, so the thing about the UK. I tabbed over, like, after I defeated the US, I tabbed over to see, like, what was going on with the UK and Germany. Well, Germany wasn't even playing a naval invasion when I checked, which didn't make any sense why they weren't trying to do a naval invasion. Uh, I did lose a few carriers around the British Isles, which really kind of ticked me off just a little bit. Especially after I saw that Germany wasn't doing anything at all. So basically I used the state transfer tool mod to give myself Munster. Just because there's literally no other way for me to invade. Um, going all the way from North America to the UK without even Iceland or Greenland uh, was not going to happen. Especially as they could like bomb my ships. So... I figured, I just gave myself Munster, I made an agreement with Germany, and I also gave them in something in return, maybe. Oh wait, when did India come out? Huh. Um, I don't remember allowing that to happen, so let's see. Yeah, I totally don't remember doing that, maybe I forgot about it. But that's a little better. I also had an X Manchuko just because I thought it was time. I gave these guys a port just so I could like give them convoys, or we could like I could give them Lundleys to lower their autonomy. That's why I did that. Uh, Australia wasn't too bad. You already saw that. Why does the Netherlands own? Eh, whatever. I, I can't be bothered at this point. I, I would take it normally, but regardless, this was definitely a uh, campaign. Exp using the Expert 4.0 AI mod. It was definitely different. It was definitely better in some ways than normal Hoi 4 AI, and sometimes it was kind of questionable, but regardless of the fact, I hope you enjoyed the campaign. If you did, consider leaving a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you all tomorrow or in a different campaign. Thanks for watching, and have a great rest of your day!